The one thing I would tell myself not to worry so much about, uh, the baby will sleep. Eventually the baby is going to sleep through the night. No matter what, that's just the way, it, the way things work. Enough time will go by where the baby will sleep through the night. Um, and the baby is uh, also eventually gonna give up that soother. So don't stress too much about that. When I was in the moment was nursing all of my babies. Um, one was great at it, one was so-so at it, and one was horrible. And in the moment, you're worried about your child gaining weight, and are they healthy, and you know, am I nursing correctly? Um, and then you look back, and they all got fed, and they were all fine, no matter which way they did it. Um, gotten less strict about the naps, and really, uh, it doesn't make a difference in the long run. I mean, children will nap when they need to nap. They will nap, you know, on the go if they need to, in the car. I would probably tell myself not to worry about upsetting my family, um, about spending a ton of time together, that it would all work out and that we would all be super close and everything would, would be really fun and exciting. I thought that I could never say no because that would impede their growth in some way. Sleep training. It's important, don't get me wrong, um, but I was pretty particular about it to a point where I had daily logs. Um, I'd avoid outings or events so not to disrupt the schedule. Um, I'm sure many parents do this, is they compare um, whether the literature that we're reading about, you know, what your child will, should be at at two months, should be at in development at six months. Um, just embrace your child and let your child just develop.